an alleged hazing incident happened here at the Clarion Goldfield Dallas High School about two weeks ago. And now some parents say they're so worried they want to pull their kids out of school. An alleged hazing incident that happened here at Clarion Goldfield Dallas High School has exposed a rash of alleged incidents. Police Chief Steve Terhark tells us a group of three older football players would grab a younger player, take the player into a room at the school, hold him down, and use their fingers to assault him. After every incident, it, they said that was a initiation, your freshman initiation. What happened here is part of a disturbing national trend in high schools. It was like the most disgusting thing I've ever heard of. You know, there's a lot of sick stuff, but come on. To do that to a kid? Can you, it's going to scar him for life. Tierhark says the alleged hazing incidents would happen in between classes. Football players, two seniors and one junior, would randomly pull freshmen into rooms and assault them. Tierhark says the players weren't specifically targeted. If the suspects saw a freshman player without any witnesses around, they would assault him. Tierhark says two weeks ago an incident was reported, and now a total of at least six victims have come forward. It's kind of surprising because the school didn't let none of the parents know nothing like that, but it kind of makes me want to take my kids out of school here. Julie Samora has three daughters in the Clarion Goldfield Dallas School District. It comes down to my kids. What if they're going to grab the little kids, or you know what I mean, like a girl in this hazing incident? I know it was all boys, but it's, it's just scary. It's scary beyond the point. It's scary. The suspects, one adult and two juveniles, will face two charges each, hazing and assault. Superintendent Robert Olson declined to go on camera citing student privacy issues, but he did say on the phone that the school board voted to expel three students until the end of the school year. He would not let us know whether these expulsions are related to the alleged hazing incidents or not. Live in Clarion, Vanessa Payne, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.